Hey everyone, Dr. Raval here. Just want to show you our new fancy, smancy, extra small masks that some of you will need to wear uh, for your treatment uh, when, you when you come in to see us. The state has required that everybody, every patient, wear a mask while they're having a treatment with an esthetician or one of our nurses um, or our other injectors. Um, this will have to stay on. We are making some extra small masks that will allow our estheticians and nurses and injectors um, to access the cheek area going all the way to all the way to your nasal labial fold area um, and um, that is a, actually a requirement by the state so we will not be able to treat around the lips or the wrinkles in the upper lip as well uh, during um, this face mask requirement. Obviously for me if I have a patient that needs nasal treatment or treatment around their nose and mouth, um, that doesn't apply. But for me, th if that's going to be the case, I will be wearing an N95 mask, eye shields, as well as this face shield to ensure uh, adequate protection for both you and me. Other things that have changed in our office, we sent out an email just recently. I'll, I'll go over that real quickly. Um, one, we'd like you to come alone. Obviously, if it's a parent coming with a child, uh, we can have one parent come in the office with them, um, but um, aside from that, we are going to ask you to try to come alone as much as possible. Uh, we will email you your paperwork, so hopefully you can have the paperwork done when you come into the office, and then we can get you straight into the treatment room. Uh, again, we are in the county of Denver, Denver, so when you come into the office, you need to have a face mask with you. We'll switch you over to a smaller face mask if we are going to do a treatment along your cheek or nasal labial fold. We will check your temperature when you come in. If you have a fever, unfortunately, we won't be able to treat you uh, that day. Um, it would probably be a good idea to call the Department of Public Health to see what you do next. And a lot of that will be based, will be based on your other symptoms. Um, and we will try to get everybody taken care of in the room, including checking in and checking out. So once you're done checking out, you can leave straight from your treatment room back to your car so, uh, so you won't need to stop off at the front desk um, on the way out. And then just to let you know, we are going to thoroughly sanitize the rooms when you leave, and we're going to wipe down all countertops and chairs um, with um, uh, bleaching solutions or sterilizing solutions. Looking forward to seeing everybody. It's been a long wait for all of us. I uh, hope you've all been staying safe, and we'll see you in our office real soon. Thanks.